yo, 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 TNT Dynamite here, the explosive one, and we are playing The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We are in a new home. As you can see, we have an upstairs now. We've moved some things around. The kitchen, once on the back wall, is now over here. And upstairs, we keep, of course, our great deity, who still will not b bestow blessing on us because we lack the necessary uh, dowry to to, uh, to stimulate her. What are we doing today? Besides expanding the home, oh, you know what we're here today to talk about? Just got back from the Weezer concert. I bet you're wondering, Dynamite, how'd the Weezer concert go? It was all right. All right, we're going down here to the south. No, I'm gonna talk about it more for real. Uh, it was it was actually it was pretty amazing. I was I never f really feel myself get excited for stuff like that, but uh I have to admit that I was pretty pumped to go see some Weezer, man. It was pretty good. They played a lot of the old school songs. There was a lot of gray beards in the audience, a lot of a lot of older gentlemen and uh seasoned ladies. But uh I did I did enjoy it when uh Buddy Holly went off, the crowd erupted. Say it ain't so. Every everybody lost their minds. It's crazy. I bet you're thinking next. D hey, Dynamite, did they play anything off of the album that you like? Because I know you you like a different album than the conventional man. Well, yes, I am a fan of the White Album, and no, they didn't play a single song off of the White Album. And yes, I wrote a strongly worded letter to the administration. <laughs> And I've been assured is that I will be compensated. With that being said, we are going to go to the desert island. Tornado Beach. Clodeth Rock. And there's another little place back here. But that is the plan. Alright, well, you know what? We're gonna we're just gonna handle the light work while we're here. Light work it up. Smack them down. Oh, I'm sorry, is that your is that your mouthpiece? Disguise. Transformers, robots, and disguise. Say it ain't so. Oh, oh, oh. My love is a heartbreaker. Ah, lovely Palomari Beach. So what, what was my favorite song at the Weezer concert? I'm happy to tell you, man. It was definitely the Buddy Holly. I knew every word, and I used my mouth to, to sing them all. You better believe. Are you a singer at a concert? I am. I don't care. I have no shame. I have no shame anyway, though, honestly. I, I go out in public. I'm, I'm, I'll talk to people. Well, I probably won't talk to people because people are weird. And I don't trust them because they probably just think bad things about me. You know, you the people who know, they know what I'm talking about. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I will go out and I will make a complete ass of myself in public because, like, like who cares, you know? I don't, I don't know. I've been known to embarrass uh, loved ones <laughs> with with my behavior. Um. So, look, this thing has a sale on it uh, but we we ain't using this all right take a look at her she's a beautiful creation of majesty the ss dynamite the crazy town crusader the skip to my lou my darling we're gonna christen her is she buoyant yes she can and where are we headed to greater frontiers, my man. <laughs> ho, ho, and the weatherman comes to feed me sugar and tea and rum. <laughs> you know, I was, uh, while we were at the show, actually, uh, the song My Name is Jonas was played because they played everything off of the Blue album. I honestly, I don't understand the lyrics much like I, I tend to not understand what Jonas is talking about sometimes, you know, but it's all right. It's all right because honestly, that song is a masterpiece. The kid Jonas, he, he's a masterpiece too, right? And you're a masterpiece. You're, you're definitely a piece of something. All right, baby, we made it. 
Thank you. You served us well. You served us well. All right. What's the deal over here? What's the dealio, though? Just free shit? I mean, I'll take it. I love it out here, man. Actually, can I just move my house out here? This would be lovely. A spring? Perhaps spring is sprung? Okay, see, so I did. I played through Breath of the Wild, so I recognize this island. It's it's very, very, very similar, if not the exact same, to the island in Breath of the Wild. And you you lose all of your equipment, and you come here, and then you have to like kind of start from zero, just like hitting stuff with sticks until you can get like some real weaponry. And then you, you build up your arsenal, and then you come over here, and you take out a hen ox, and then you make it to the top of the mountain. It's honestly like an epic little adventure. One of the hot... What the hell is that, man? Okay. <laughs> I've seen it before. It's honestly like one of the one of the best parts of, of that game. I always thought it was really, really awesome the way it, it uh, kind of played out. But I thought it would come back, but it appears as though it has not. Look at him go. You can't unstick me, boy. I'm unstickable. I mean, I'm I mean, I am I'm too stickable. Everybody look at how stickable I am. Enemies, he wants to smoke. You see him? He's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. We're going to go ahead and get this headshot. Miss this headshot. Get that. Get him out of here. Oh, we got a we got a little little mixer going on here, huh? Riju, set me up. Set me up, girl. I'm about to I'm about to pop the frick off. You see that? You see it go? They don't even know I'm here. Get him, you nobo. Getting that ass. Smack him. Monster forces. What's this a boot? I'm confused. But I know how to take out monster forces. If there's one thing I know how to do, it's handle the forces. He dies. He dies from that. He dies. You die. You die from that. All right. <laughs> You know, I'm, I'm honestly I'm gonna be pissed if it's if it's that last guy down there, and that's the reason I can't I can't progress. If it, if it were any other creature, they would be dead because you know, like you fall from a high distance and you think maybe you you pass away from that. But not this guy. He's different breed. And back up quick, drummers. I'm here to tell you right now, man, drummers deserve, they deserve a special place in heaven, all right? If, uh, watching the show that went on for like 45 minutes and the drummer playing every song, like back to back to back, because that's, that's the way that they got down. It was back to back to back songs, and the drummer was just, he was working his ass off. So I'm here to tell you right now that if you if you're not a drummer, you're not a real man. Oh my god, that's gonna blow. Like I choose to be a real man, so occasionally I'll tap on a desk or something just to assert dominance. Anything percussion works. Soaring a boomerang. I mean, I guess I should take it. I don't know what it is. I th honestly, I thought there would be uh, I thought there'd be a little bit more over here. I'm uh, kind of at a loss of words for that. And let's go up. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little disappointed. Whoa, there's a cavernous hole. Let's check out the cavern. I was just about to say I'm a little disappointed in the, the poor showing here, but whoa, there's some new stuff. No, I need that. We may need you yet, sir. I'm gonna need you to stay here. Okay, okay. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. All right. I was honestly thinking that this whole island was a bust. I was about ready to bust Miyazaki in the mouth. Miyazaki didn't make this game. I don't care. 
he has it coming. All right, we got this is this is weird. This shouldn't be deserted, right? There should be enemies here. Hello. The gentle creature rests until we thwart its evil plans. Give me your bulbul gem, boy. Feed it to me with your fingers. All right, so there's gotta be more here. Like, look at all of this business going on. There seems to be a lot of business going on and I aim to get to the bottom of it. Hmm. Oh no, that hurt. What's that about? It's a puzzle. Oh no, I'm not good at puzzles though. We know that. All right, we made it up. Marimarini Marini Shrine. But uh, how do we how do we get in? If you want to destroy my sweater, so apparently there's this guy who is on the island. We have now learned that he exists. I already talked to him once because I, I just thought he was like a guy. Hey, buddy, you're still hanging around wow. here. It's my mission to scout out the pirate's hideout. But there are three monster strongholds keeping me from investigating. Sigh, wish those strongholds were gone. It'd make things much easier. So he tells me about three monster forces strongholds that lie on the island. We have already taken out two of them. The last one lies over yonder. So we're gonna get over there and we're gonna go kick some monster boot high. Look at that. Look at, I can't do that. Well, you could do some of this. Some of this you could do. I still slide? I thought it was sticky. Look at that. Look at God. Look at him. I'm going the front door. This is kind of unfortunate. Oh, they've all been, they've all been, they all know. They all are aware. Read you. Jack them up. You know, Bo? Jack them up. All right, we go to this. Oh, I do it to you. Look at him. Break it on his neck. Buddy, I hate to be the one to tell you. Your friends are all dead, all right? So easily done. All right, cool. And now we'll go and see about the pirate ship. So I guess all in all, I would say is that going to see live music was surprisingly enjoyable for me. If you have a band out, if you have a band out there that you love, I, I suggest you go and see them. I wouldn't even say that I love Weezer. I just really, really like Weezer. But it it was it was great. It was it was a good time. All right, buddy, what do you got? The island seems so much more tranquil. Could it be? You cleared out the monster strongholds and all three of them at that. Oh. Ha, you're amazing. Oh, you don't even know how big a help that is. Perfect timing too, since I just saw the pirate ship coming. Uh-oh. Hmm. But it's strange, as soon as it went around the to the rear of the island, the ship disappeared. Uh-oh. I think we already know what's back there. So where did it go? Maybe the pirates really do have a hideout on this island. And that's where the ship disappeared to. But that would make it the monster control crew's duty to find out and eradicate them, not just scout things out. Jesus, man. Escalate it quickly. I can handle one or two enemies, but that sounds like more. Ugh, I'm so nervous. I'm frozen to this spot. Do I retreat or do I locate the hideout and try to fight the pirates off myself? Oh, what should I do? Buddy, you need you need to relax, all right, my man? You already, you, you basically, don't, you're even telling me the story is letting me know that you just want me to do the work. All right, either way, we'll, we'll head up here. We'll check out the pirate's lair, huh? How about them apples? Yarg, mateys, I'm coming for your booty. That's what pirates say, right? I'm pretty sure that's what pirates say. Holy sh! Look at this thing! 
That's really a whole dang pirate ship. Holy. Look, I hate to I hate to do this, man, but I'm cutting the episode here. All right, it's been it's been a long day. I need to recoup. I need to revamp. I need to reevaluate. I need to readjust. All right. When we come back, we uh hoist the missit mass and batten down the hatches and deck the halls with bowels of B words. All right. <laughs> Thanks for joining me in on the next one. We get up in here. TNT and I'm out. Take care of each other, by the way.